Hey guys, welcome back to Philips Garage. So today we're going to take a quick look at Intel's new SSDs. So basically, uh, they just released these two weeks ago. Uh, they're Series 6, they're called the 600P. Uh, they sit above the 5 series SATA drives that Intel has and underneath the 7 series, uh, such as the 750 uh, PCIe drives that they have. Uh, performance to dollar, they look pretty good, um, but what we'll do now is we'll just take a quick look at them. Uh, we've got an SM961. Samsung 850 Pro and we're going to see um, how they compare to those two drives. They are an NVMe drive, the new 600Ps. Uh, they're an M2 form factor, so they're a 2280 um, and performance wise on paper they look pretty good but um, let's see how they stack up against it. Okay now looking at some benchmarks, uh, price to storage per gigabyte. We had the Intel 600P coming at 38 cents per gigabyte, the 850 Pro at 58 cents and the SM961 at 68 cents. Uh, the advertised speeds, uh, SM961 was 3200 megabytes read and 1800 megabytes write. Uh, the 600P is 1570 megabytes read and 540 write and the 850 Pro is a, 520, a 550 read and 520 write. Uh, the 4K random reads, uh, the SM961 clear winner here at 450, 450,000 uh, read and 400,000 write, uh, the SM961 at 71,000 read and 112,000 write, and then we had the 850 Pro at 100,000 read and 90,000 write. So now onto some uh, real world benchmarks. Uh, we took a seven gigabyte uh, QuickTime file. Uh, we transferred it off our XP941 onto the drives. We had the SM961 do this in 8.3 seconds. Uh, the 600P do it in 26.4 seconds. And the 850 Pro do it in 28 seconds. The Blackmagic speed test. We took, we done the five gigabyte file test. We had the SM961 reading at 30. 3105 megabytes a second. Right, it was at 1680 megabytes a second. Moving on to the 600P, that was uh, 1372 read and 533 write. And then lastly, the 850 Pro was a 530 uh, read and a 511 write. Um, in AJA disk test, we've done a 16 gigabyte file in the 5K read format. And this was uh, a frames per second test. And we had the SM961 um, being able to produce 71 frames per second at 5K in real time. Um, the Intel 600P do that um, at 40 frames per second and then the 850 Pro not, not able to uh, sustain the frame rates at 12 frames per second. Uh, lastly we've done a quick look at boot times. Uh, Windows 10 Pro uh, the SM961 did it in 8.4 seconds, the 600P done it in 9.8 seconds and the 850 Pro in 11.2 seconds. Okay, so uh, the SM961 did win all the tests, but that was sort of uh, given, I guess, given its per performance on paper. But that's not to say the 600P is in a great drive. I think Intel have done a fantastic job in producing a M2 form factor NVMe drive at a lower cost than a SATA drive, but the performance is still up there with some of the best NVMe drives. Um, uh, would I buy it? Yeah, I think I would. So it gets a thumbs up from us. Um, if you like this video, please like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. Let me know. Um, otherwise, please subscribe to our channel and um, we'll have more videos coming soon. Thanks for watching.